Hey, what's up? Jigs are here. If you like to take photos and update your gallery from time to time, you're probably running into storage issues with either your iCloud drive or local storage. That's why it's very handy to have an external hard drive so you have additional storage options. In this video, I will show you five different methods to transfer photos from your iPhone to an external hard drive. Let's go. To facilitate a direct transfer to your external hard drive or USB flash drive without having to connect your iPhone to a computer, you need a lightning to USB camera adapter. Or use a USB-C to USB camera adapter if you have an iPhone 15 or later model. Get your devices ready. Connect either the lightning or USB-C end of your adapter to your iPhone. And then plug in your external storage device. Open the Files app on your iPhone and see if the external device is recognized and appears in the Locations panel. The valid formats required for your external drive must be APFS, APFS Encrypted, Mac OS Extended, EXFAT, FAT32, and FAT. Any other format won't be recognized by your iPhone. Once the external storage is recognized, go to Photos and select each picture you want to transfer. When all images are selected, click Share and tap Save to Files. Navigate to the External Device folder and tap Save to begin copying your photos. In case you don't have an adapter on hand, you have a no-install alternative that lets you transfer files over the web. This works best if you're transferring fewer than 100 images. Snapdrop is a free, open-source, secure online file transfer service that you can access at snapdrop.net. Before you start transferring, configure your browser's download location so that you can receive files and save them directly to your external storage. For this video, I use the Chrome browser. If you're using another, you can still follow the next steps as the browser settings tend to be similar. Click on the three-dot menu at the top right and go to Settings. Open the Downloads Configuration panel and change the destination folder to your external device. After setting up your computer's web browser, get your iPhone ready and go to snapdrop.net. Remember, your computer and iPhone must be on the same Wi-Fi network. Next, tap your computer's device alias and go to Photo Library. Select all the files you want to transfer and click Add to confirm. On your computer, wait for the Receive dialog box and click Save for each file to download it directly to your external storage device. Using iCloud Photos is another way to transfer your files online. First, make sure iCloud Photos is activated on your iPhone so your files are synced to the cloud. Open Settings and browse to Photos. Make sure iCloud Photos is enabled and set Optimize iPhone Storage to get the full resolution version of your images from iCloud. Once you have verified that your photos are synced to the cloud, open your browser on your computer and sign in with your Apple ID at iCloud.com slash photos. When the dashboard loads, select all the files you want to transfer and click the download button at the top right of the menu bar. Since the download location has been changed to your external storage, the photos should automatically be saved there. By default, multiple downloaded files are compressed, so be sure to navigate to your external device folder and extract them. For a more interactive interface to copy your photos from your iPhone to your external drive, you can use the Windows Photos application. Click the Windows key and search for Photos. At this point, both your iPhone and the external storage device must already be connected. First, add your external device folder to the program so you can directly transfer and save photos there. 
In the left sidebar panel, right-click Folders. Hit Add Folder and select your external device. After adding the folder, click on your iPhone from the External Devices menu. Note that all photos and videos stored in your gallery will appear here, provided they are also stored locally on your device, not just in the cloud. To choose your photos, you can selectively click each file, or simply check Select All to copy them all together. Next, click Add Items. Choose the external device folder you added earlier, and confirm the import to transfer your selected photos. Since Apple doesn't necessarily make it easy to transfer photos to external storage, the most convenient option is to use a third-party tool that lets you transfer your files easily in a single window. Find the link to the tool I personally use below. To try it, download and run the software after installation. Then connect your iPhone to your computer using an original or an MFI certified cable. When prompted, click the Trust button and enter your device's passcode to confirm the connection. On the dashboard, click Backup Photos to PC to transfer your files all at once. Otherwise, proceed to the Photos tab and select each file. When everything is chosen, click Export to PC and select your external device as the destination folder to complete the process. Okay, if I've been able to assist you, I would really appreciate it if you could leave a thumbs up and subscribe. And if you enjoy taking photos and videos with your iPhone, please visit my website. Over the last few months, I've created a video course where I've gathered the best tips and tricks on how to make the most out of your iPhone for photography. You'll find the link to the website in the video description. Until next time, bye!